Today's question is, should I upgrade to Canva Pro? One of the things that I heavily rely on is Canva's upgraded features to help me market my business online. And so after getting this question, I was inspired to do a new challenge on my YouTube channel called the 30 Days of Apps, where I'm going to walk you through 30 web applications or mobile applications that help my clients to save time, save money, and make money online. So of course, to kick things off, I had to start with my very favorite bootstrap app, Canva.com. Without further ado, let's hop in. So number one is photos. Within Canva directly, you can search over 60 million images on Canva. Now this is a game changer and you guys know that I love photography. It's a way that I express myself and the ability to have access to all these images within the Canva site itself is a game changer. So I can even type in really specific things like a flat lay. And here are all of these images available for me to use. Now, I don't know what happened with Canva behind the scenes, but these images are absolutely beautiful. And I see them on paid sites all the time. But here, everything is already included if you are paying for Canva Pro. Yes, of course, they have some free images that they pull from sites like Unsplash, but I'm telling you, the fact that you can be this specific and get stunning images like this is a game changer and it is totally worth the $9.95 a month, even if this was all that you got. So if you have not clicked on the photos tab and seen all the upgrades they've done to the photo library, I would tell you, you need to hop over to Canva because this changed the game for me. I don't even look at any other stock sites now because I can truly get everything I need directly within the site itself. Number two is design elements. One of the ways that graphic designers elevate their designs is overlapping elements. Now, everyone knows that Canva has shapes like this available, but what a lot of people don't know is Canva has all of these fun squigglies and even hand-drawn elements that you tend to see with paid graphics on other sites. So if you click on Featured, you can start to see some of those intricate little elements, but I would encourage you to actually type in hand drawn because when you do that, you're going to start seeing some complex stuff that I bet you didn't know Canva had to offer. These types of designs you would typically see on a site like Creative Market and you guys know I love some Creative Market designs. But hand-drawn, I mean watercolor elements, are available in Canva Pro. So unless you search for these by name, you may not even notice that these are available. And I'm telling you, they are absolutely beautiful. So make sure that you search hand-drawn the next time you're using your Canva Pro account to see some of these amazing design elements they've added to the back end. Number three is fonts. Now, Canva Pro has over 1,000 fonts that you can utilize and you can upload fonts of your own. So if you're trying to make sure that your branding stays consistent across all of your marketing and you have purchased a font from another site, you can upload it directly into Canva and under uploaded fonts, you can see the fonts that I have uploaded myself. Then you're going to see popular fonts and if you continue to scroll down, You'll see that Canva has even started to categorize their fonts, like English fonts or even script fonts. So if I type in calligraphy, for example, it's going to pull up a category of Canva fonts that look like hand-drawn text. And so I absolutely love these options because back in the day, all you really had was great vibes and playlists and everyone was using this font. Now we have some more exciting options to choose from directly within Canva itself. 
Number four is brand kit. And this is a huge, huge benefit to people who create graphics for multiple organizations. I volunteer at my church, I volunteer with Rotary, and I create graphics for my businesses. And so it's important that I have my branding readily available. So within the brand kit feature of Canva Pro, you can upload all of your logos directly to Canva and you can upload your color palettes. So when you choose the colors for your business, you can upload those colors directly into Canva to make sure, again, that your branding stays consistent. All you have to do is hit the plus sign and simply add the hex code below and you will have access to that within the design panel. So if I go to create a design and I simply choose Instagram post, if I like a template that Canva provides, but I want to make sure that the fonts match my branding, all I've got to do is select that. And down here, you're going to see document colors, but then you will start to see all of my color palettes. And so this is a fantastic way for your visual branding to stay consistent. Number five is magic resize. Within Canva Pro, you can magically resize your designs for multiple formats. If I click on Instagram post and I want to make a sales graphic for my business, I can simply type in sales and select a template. I can create exactly what I need for my Instagram feed. And when I'm ready, I can click on resize, select Instagram story, and simply copy and resize. And what it will do is automatically resize it for Instagram stories in a brand new design. So if you are creating multiple graphics for your business, whether it is Facebook cover photos or Instagram posts, you can utilize Magic Resize to save yourself a lot of time. Number six is templates. Canva is always expanding their library of template designs to respond to the time of the year or the times that we are in. So you're always going to see holiday specific designs available for you if you click on the template area of the back end, but there's also things that pop up in the moment. Like say for instance, all of these custom designs specifically about COVID-19. Now, if you click on Instagram stories, they even have some designs available that involve multiple pages. So you can utilize Canva Pro to tell a story with your designs. They have done not only all the design, but all the copywriting for you, which is a huge time saver. And all you need to do is modify the colors and simply add your logo. Canva even has some categories of templates available to help you engage your Instagram following, like the this or that story templates, and you can even do the ask me anything. Not only is all the design work done for you, but they even tell you where to place the question story sticker. Number seven is remove background. I don't know if you realize this, but within Canva Pro, you can actually remove the background from a Canva Pro image in just a couple clicks. So on the side where we see trending images, I just dropped in this Canva Pro image and then I'm going to click on effects and at the very top you will see background remover. All you need to do is to click that effect and within a few seconds what Canva is going to do is scan that image and it is going to automatically remove the background. So there is the after and again here is the before. So if we take this and we drag the image, I can simply click on the side and click on background and you can see that the background has been completely replaced. Number eight is animation. Within Canva, you have a ton of opportunities to not only utilize their animations, but animate things of your own. And that's exactly how I create those animated graphics for my YouTube channel. So all I did was I dropped in these elements and in the top left hand corner, you will see the button animate. And if I click on that, 
All I have to do is select the style that I want to use and Canva will automatically animate the elements. This is an amazing time saver and it's one of the ways that I can turn out content super quick on this YouTube channel because I'm able to do this stuff in Canva. Then all I need to do is to click on download and it will download it as a video. Now, if I go to Instagram, what you can also do is you can simply type in animated in the search bar. And that is going to pull up some of the animated Instagram templates. So again, it will export it as a video, but this is a fun way for you to make your Instagram posts more engaging. And so if you've never tried that before, simply type in animated once you have selected an Instagram post, and now you can easily create an animation. Last but certainly not least is unlimited folders. For those of you who like to stay organized, you can simply organize your designs within Canva. Now, what I did for a recent presentation is I scanned my entire account and I put all of my designs that I had done for Rotary in a folder. So you can create folders on your main page to help you group designs, but you can also utilize folders to help you organize your uploads. So if you like to utilize your own photos and you click on uploads, yes, you can add everything in a pretty disorganized fashion here, or you can simply create your own folders. And a quick way to do that is just to scroll down to the bottom, click folders, and then click on create new. When you do that, you can name your folder. You can also do subfolders. So if you open up a folder, and you want to nest a folder inside, just click on the three dots and create a new folder. So I know this was a super comprehensive video, but I hope it got you excited about all the possibilities that you have at your disposal by using a Canva Pro account. So make sure that you click on the link in my description if you've never used this website or if you're interested in upgrading because by clicking on my link, you are supporting this channel. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe because I am going to teach you how to grow your biz without breaking the bank. Until next time, to ta for now. Thank you so much for stopping by Bootstrap Biz Advice. If you would like access to my resource library, which I call the VIP Vault, make sure that you click on the link in my description.